we are live with freaks. Welcome to the morning boot camp. Let's get rolling. Let's get ready. What you need today is just one single dumbbell and it's cardio. So we're gonna bring up the heart rate like crazy. We're gonna have fun. We are going to have fun. Let's see who's going to be with me today. I have a special guest here. He's hiding right here. <laughs> Come on, Tysi. Oh, you, you're taking mine? Okay. Everybody loves my stretch job. All right, let's start on the floor. We gotta warm up. We gotta. Well, I already did my phone rolling. I spent a good 10 minutes on rolling, rolling, rolling. You guys should do the same. So if you replay the video, you should pause it and do your own foam rolling. That's how you should start. And then you can do exactly what we're doing right now with a stretch drop. So keep your other leg bent. Let's start bringing the leg up and down. Toes are down. You want to have a good stretch in your hamstrings. Hamstrings and glutes are usually tight because of sitting, driving, right? Any kind of sedentary will cause your hemis to be, hemis to be tight. I see, leg straight, leg straight. There you go, oh yeah. Toes are down. Let's do this. Now we're gonna go with that leg out to the side. Now I'm gonna extend this leg out to the side and back again. And out to the side. Shoulders back, chest is out. Yes, 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 bring it down, 90 degrees. And bring it back up. 90. And just up. We want to stretch the inner thighs. Good. Now we're going to go across. Ready? Right arm on the floor. Across. And back up again. Try to keep that shoulder on the floor. So what's going to happen is when you bring that leg over, you don't want your whole body to rotate. That arm is on the floor. And it also stretches the whole front of your arm. Tyson, do you, do you feel that in your arm? You feel it? Like I feel it here for, still from push-ups. Oh, well, we did some push-ups yesterday. And now we're getting ready for the bike ride. So we have what? Three weeks left? I think so. Three weeks left for the big 24-hour bike ride. Now we're going to go into the quad stretch right here. Over the shoulder, push your hips forward. Feel really the quad stretching. That's why I always recommend the stretch chart. Because if you're going to do this, you're not going to feel this as much as you do this with that strap. And even you're going to hold for a few seconds and then kick it forward. And then hold, hold. Get that, get that body to really, really the muscles along it. It feels so good. And... Let's do the glute stretch. This will help you with the glute stretch too. So the knee will be slightly bent. Bring it in. And then you can reset it. And again, bring it in. And reset it. And again, bring it in. And reset. Nice. Good. Let's go on the other leg. Let's go on the other leg. Oh yes, this one is tight. Even though the, the phone rolling, you see how different forms of stretching is important. So toes are down, down, and bring it back up and hold. I like to hold for a few seconds just to feel the stretch in my hamstring. Bring it down and come right back up. And again. Good, good, good. Keep on going. And out to the side. When I extend my other leg, I to make sure that the leg is straight through the knee. Yes, that's very important. Straight through the knee. And back up again. And down. And back up again. And down. Good, good, good. All feels good. Now across, the other shoulder goes on the floor. 
I will hold here for a second. I'll give a moment. More than the lower back is the shoulder for me. I feel it still. Good. And let's kick it forward. Let's do the quad stretch. Sideways. Bottom leg is slightly bent. And kick it forward and bring it over again. You don't, you guys don't want to kick it? Fine. Don't kick it. But make sure that that strap goes over the shoulder. That you are stretching. Feeling it. Feels good after all the crazy workouts we did yesterday. Right guys, the project workout was crazy. Crazy good. Crazy good. And time, you should feel already better now. Okay, when I put those away, we're gonna get the single dumbbell. Of course, get some water, get some pre-workout, keep on sitting. You still have a little moment here. We're going to be memorizing as many exercises as we can. We're going to set up the clock for ourselves. So it's, it's smooth. And listen up. Here comes the game today. Do you remember like I did this strength class that we couldn't put the dumbbell down? Well, we're going to do the same for the cardio today. We're going to have one dumbbell in our hands. And I'm going to be telling you when to switch. So you are not allowed to switch when you feel like. Pay attention. I'm going to call it switch. If I don't call it switch, that means that it's the same arm. Now, if you're going to put the dumbbell down, the penalty is 10 push-ups, okay? The only way that you can put the dumbbell down is switching. Switching the dumbbells because something is too heavy and you need to adjust. Other than that, by literally putting one down, grabbing the other one. That's the whole idea, okay? So we're gonna start with nice and simple shuffle. Okay, so join me just now. We're just gonna get into a shuffle mode before we're gonna start with the number. Okay, so shuffle across the room, just like this. Feet are apart. So guys, this is very important with the shuffle. Feet are apart, okay? We shouldn't be shuffling, bringing feet together. You should never skip him like this. Knees should be slightly bent so you can engage the quads and in your glutes. And this is the shuffle, okay? So that's how we're gonna be shuffling today a long time. Then we're gonna be switching to stationary exercises. The 30, 30 seconds clock is ready. Basically, which number are you gonna, are you gonna be pressing, jumping, jacking, and all kinds of things. I'm gonna take the eight. For now, this is the first round, and you can always, we're gonna probably switch, we're gonna probably switch them to like jack press out. So look, I'm gonna put these here. Look, guys, five and three, so for the crossing out. All right, we ready? Right arm starting. At the shoulder, that's it, go. <whistles> Shuffling, that's it. We're not adding any motion here, just the shuffle, side to side. Just the shuffle. So you're not resting that dumbbell on your shoulder. No, no, no. The dumbbell is just right above the shoulder. Right above the shoulder. A lot of shuffle, my friends, today. A lot of shuffle. So get ready. We've done so many squat rests and pull outs this week. Okay, right here. We're gonna pump the squat right on. So, see, I didn't call the switch. We are right here. Keep on squatting. They just started. We're gonna imagine that there is no breaks here unless we're gonna be really huffing and puffing and we will need one. Deep breath in and exhale. Don't rest the dumbbell on your shoulder. That's the whole idea. To feel it right here. You're gonna feel this in your bicep. Shoulders back, chest is out. I already feel mine. Just squat. Push your hips back. Nice and easy. We're just getting one up. Switch your arms. Now you can lower the arm dumbbell down, just like this. Shake it, and we're gonna go right into shuffle on your left arm. You ready? Let's go. Shuffle. So that's what I said. Literally, 
you don't have it on board, maybe you have a small water, small bottle of water, a little splash hammer. What else could be, could be spicy? Think about what people can use if they don't have a dumbbell. What could they use? Guys, right, so what do you think? No? No idea? But I think bottle of water would be good. So, now we're gonna start squatting, right? Squatting the same side. Let's do this. You can start immediately after the clock rains, or I always think 30 seconds, you have that 10 second break. Deep breath in and exhale. Dumbbell should not be close towards your shoulder. And we're gonna go to shuffle, straight up, and squat, jet curl, okay. All right. We know the second group, right arm. Right arm. Straight up. Go right into shuffle, let's go. So arm is up, fully extended right here. Fully extended arm. Oh yeah, lock the arm over. We're gonna have all these different positions as we're gonna go through the shuffles. Now we're gonna start jumping in the second part of the exercise. We got our legs warmed up, more. So now we're gonna do jack and curl on the right side. So look, feet are wide, boom, down and up, go. Squat, curl, jump, curl, low, back is straight. Push your hips back. Deep breath in and exhale. Down and up. And we're gonna be doing this on both sides. And we're gonna go straight through the list. All right, left arm. We're gonna lock the left arm. I'm getting warm, I'm fitting you. Not yet. Go, shuffle, arm is straight. Keep your knees slightly bent. Left arm, left arm, that's it. You can keep the other hand here, if it's easier for you. But the whole idea is to keep that arm overhead locked. Guys, this is full 60 minutes. Now we know what we have to do on the left. We're not gonna drop the dumbbell. We are not doing push-ups unless you wanna go right here. Jack and curl. You can go slow, you can go fast. You can just walk your feet out and in without jumping. You can literally stay here and just do squat and curl if you cannot jump. The jump, the high intensity jump is for people that have healthy legs, right? And hips and glutes, nothing bothers you. Then you're gonna adjust the clock. Shuffle. We're gonna go into straight out. Jet press right. Straight out, I'm switching the number. Can you hit? Go. Straight out, go. We're shuffling, right on. Go, go, go. So now arm is out. Totally out, guys. Like this. Keep on going. You see, I'm just showing them quickly here. Let's go. Out, out, out. Holding it. Abs are tight. Glutes are tight. Now we're gonna go jack press up with your right arm. So right here, boom, 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 boom. I think I'm gonna be switching too a lot of times. Because I need a little heavier one. I don't wanna go too light, but this is cardio. So you don't wanna go heavy here. No, this is 
something that will challenge you after 30 seconds, you're gonna feel it. Ouch! This shoulder, this bicep is on fire. Okay? So arm is up, when feet are out, stiff abs. Back to your left one. Keep on switching. Me and Tyson keep on switching. Left arm out, straight up, going. Your heart rate should be up. Now you know how to hold that arm straight up. Quick switch because we gotta do jack press. Using the fives, I'm using the eight. And we're going, pumping. Messi, stay on the camera. On the high one, the up one. I'm puffing and puffing because it should be like this. Now we're gonna go jack curl to press on the left. Let's do this. Woo. Jack curl press. Harder than up, 
body, your body will tell you, your arm will tell you how it really behaves. Good. Now we have what we have, guys. We have right here, like we did squat. When I start with the right leg, right arm, right here, just holding it. That's it. Pumping, pausing, pause, pause. I am at 90 degrees with both legs. Look, just here. Stay on camera, stay on camera. Right here. Down and up. I see Instagram, can see you. Down and up. That's it. We're not jumping. We're just going up and down. We're gonna do one more time on our left. And the whole first group is done. Go. And guess what? <laughs> we gotta repeat this all over again. Straight from the top. Press, press, press. So those are low rounds. Now left leg forward and hold the dumbbell close towards your shoulder. And we're going up and down. The same idea. Leg shoulder with the bar. Go up and down. Or you can go here. Right here. This one burns. Oh yeah. And time. Now it's a long break. In this break, you gotta, you have to stretch, drink, water. time guys it took us like 20 minutes we do this one well maybe a little bit less because we did the warm-up but this was good straight through now we're gonna push it i want you to adjust the weight so if you feel that this was a little bit not challenging enough you gotta do a different weight sip of water Do some pull-ups, guys. Do some pull-ups. I'm gonna wait for you. This is not rising. I'm gonna stretch right here. this remember from the top from the first one so adjust your weight I'm going a little heavier shuffle at the shoulder right on oh let's start with the left arm let's start everything on the left okay Left arm. Ready? Go. Just shuffling. So this round we starting on the left. Holding the dumbbell right here. Tons of abs. Your shoulder. Your bicep. Tricep. Cardio fat burning. Push. You can go quick. You can go slow. Depends how much space you have. We've done shuffles with medicine balls. We told you this guys before. Now we're gonna go 
squatting, right? So you can start right now if you want. You can even stay here, pause, go into a little bit burning action on your legs, or just go into a squat up and down. If your knees bother you, you don't need to go all the way down on the squat. You can go quarter squat. Oh yeah, this one is killing, I can feel it. Woo! This one doesn't want that weight. Five seconds. Definitely challenging. Ah, switch. Right arm. Shuffle. This one got me muscular fatigue. But it's in a different way when you just lift it. This one was holding. It was isometric contraction right here. Holding it, squeezing it. You will not feel this in your shoulders. So try to stiff, keep that arm stiff. So it doesn't bounce, doesn't move all over because you're gonna hurt your shoulder. You want this as stiff as possible, engaging your bicep, okay? And now right here, going right into a squat. You could extend the arm like we did. And now into squatting. Up and down. Down and up. Stay straight too. Don't lean to your right side now just because you have a dumbbell on your right, okay? Nice work, guys. Now we're gonna go into left overhead hold, left straight up, straight up. Overhead hold, shuffling. So left arm, remember left arm is first. Two exercises. Stiff arm, right here. I think we could totally even hold heavy weight right here for now at least. But then we have Jack and Curl on the left. Stiff, stiff arm. Stay straight. All right. We're doing Jack and Curl. So you have to have a weight that's going to allow you to do this. Jump. Curl it up towards the shoulder. You can't jump, you're going to walk your feet. Do this squat and curl. Do what you can. Activate that curl. Right arm. Now it's time to switch, right? Woo! Who is doing the penalties? Anybody? Push-ups because you dumped the dumbbell and you couldn't hold it. Shuffle. Shuffle right here. Good work, everybody. Stiff arm. Let's go. Good work, good work. Lower it down, but don't dump it. Jack and curl on your right. That's how you're feeling. Good? Who can go faster than me? Who can go faster than me? And Tyson. Almost there, guys. Oh, I'm switching. Left arm straight out. Left arm straight out. Three, two, one, go. Shuffle. Woo. Holding the arm. 
Straight out. Go. Straight out, arm. Kind to you. Elbow should be just slightly bent. That's it. I'm gonna do a high five with my right. Bam, bam. Keep on going. Good job. Nice. Jack. Jack press right. There you go. I gotta switch to my heavier one because before I think I didn't do it. I actually wanted the 10 pounders. Oh yeah. Now I'm feeling good. So on the out, I had five, but on the press, I'm doing 10. But remember, it's cardio. Right arm. So now, you know uh, your abilities to do that. Let's do it. Shuffle. I, I bumped, I popped this up with the weed. But remember, this is fast. You should not be going so on those jacks. This is ripping, strong, fast, hard. You gotta release that energy. You gotta push yourself. Shuffling straight up. Arm is out, arm is out. Hold it. That's tight. Now I'm switching to my 10. Jack press. Thanks for joining me on this one. Jack press. Remember, fast. Speed. Speed. Boom. Boom. Nice work. Ha. 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 Go. 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 All the way up. And down. Towards the shoulder.
cardio session, back burning workout. Ah. All right, now we're pressing out. I'm switching. I'm switching the forms. But I need your assistance. Pressing out. Left side, remember starting this round. Ready? Let's do this, guys. We are on a good path right here. Pressing up. Look, I'm coming to you. Pressing and high five. Boom. Hope you came to the screen to give me a high five. Just gonna go left leg forward. Just gonna stay here. Pause up and down split squat. Ready? That's it. We started with squat. Now we're gonna finish in with the split squat here. Just pausing, holding. That's it. 90 degree angle with both legs. Burn it. Hold that dumbbell. Don't drop it. We're almost there. Hard, right? Pressing out. Pressing out. Right on. This is it. For this round. Go. Oh, he put the dumbbell down. Oh, too bad. Look at him pumping those push-ups. Machine boy. Good work, guys. It's only nine and pumping the push-ups. He wants to do that. That's how it should be. Ha! Pump it. Is the clock coming? Oh wow! Right leg forward. Split squat. Holding, pausing, squeezing your butt cheeks. Go down and up. Right here. Yes, yes, yes. Halfway through. Let's check the time. For 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Not 15 minutes left. Remember, hydrate. I just got, guys, I went through all my concoction this morning, step by step, what I did. Check it out. Check it out on Instagram, eva.eckert1. Make sure you follow and do your concoction if you don't know how send a message and i will teach you how to do this concoction of course herbalife and mix of truly nutrition here let's stretch the quads guys hold it steady deep breath in through your nose exhale through your lips other leg shoulders back chest is out gonna go with the next round but the next round is gonna be of course different again different than the previous round that's the whole challenge here okay so listen up listen up how we're gonna do the next round you know the exercises we're going to do both shuffles switching the dumbbells and then we're gonna do lower body back to back. You ready? So we're going to start with right arm, right arm shuffle, left arm shuffle, 
right squat, left squat. So shuffles are together and the other section is together. Let's do this. Stacey, you're gonna hit the clock. Let's do this. So right arm shuffle, I'm using 10. Give me your number and what you're using for the dumbbells, I would like to know. Three, two, one. Right arm shuffle. Now you know that the further arm is also different. Let's do it, shuffling, shuffling. Now, if it's too light here, you're not gonna feel it. This whole point is to feel in your abs. Good, tight abs. Remember, core, core, the way how peak performance, how peak physique is working on the core is multifunctional level. All different ways you're gonna think it's core. Chest press is core. Bend over lower is core. Everything is core when you think about it. People think I wanna have a just a six pack, right? Yes, great. But you gotta think front and back, being able to do fast motion, slow motion, lifting, and always engage your abs. I have to tell you for me. It's still a challenge after having two C-sections, after having the hernia repair. I have a mesh inside my stomach, that's why sometimes it's holding out, but there's nothing that I can do right now for this. It's just training, right? That's it. So now squat on your right, and then squat on your left. Let's do this, Stacy. Let's do it with me. Nice and low. You are warmed up here. This is work. How is everybody doing today? I hope you're having an excellent morning, day, evening. You guys are gonna be replaying this 24 hours a day. Left arm squat. people on board from other countries. English is international language. Awesome way to train everyone in the world. Down, 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 and up. So now you know how the workout goes, right? This round, because we switched it. Now we're gonna go overhead, hold. Where's my workout? Just to see, somebody was catching it. Right arm, shuffle, shuffle back to back right now. Stiff, tight, strong. Look where my arm is. I'm staying straight. I'm not leaning to one side, totally straight. That's how I want you to be. Now you know that left arm shuffle. Straight up. Straight up. Hold it, go, go. Abstain. Remember what I told you. Core. This is core. Hardy core. Now we're gonna do jack and curl on your right. Different challenge. This is gonna be challenge because now we're gonna jump back to back, but you're gonna have 10 seconds of a break in between. So push it here, go all out hard. Your arm will recover here. Then I'm using different arm. Few seconds, few seconds. One more on the left. Oh yeah, burning. And then you have to reset, I see. Next round is holding 
the dumbbell straight out. Straight out. Oh yeah, burning. Oh. Straight out. Changing the dumbbell.
press it, press it, right arm. We're gonna have one more, eight. Oh. Guys, we better switch on the left. Who wants to do penalty push-up? Pop that push-up. Let's go. Let's, let's here, but we still gotta press out. Finish off the third round now. Breathe out. Wide squat, curl to press, full control over your body. Huh. Remember, everything starts in your head. Head is what's gonna tell you. Give up, get up. Don't put that dumbbell unless you want some push-ups. Pressing out, we're gonna slide by the switch for the press out part. Whew. Pressing out, pressing out. Three, two, one. Jinky Tyson, you guys have a lesson of Polish right now. Jinky thank you. And he is fluent in Polish. Funny story about things people tell me. He's gonna get confused. How can you teach him those languages? He will be so confused. You can not teach him. Said I am. And I will. And he's going to just be just fine. Look, he's like a machine. He's a machine. My drogi. Dziewięcioletnia maszyna. Let's go. Pressing out. Left arm. Left arm. Pump it. Because we are almost at the end. <laughs> pump it, pump it, almost there. Shoulders back, chest is out. We do those workouts every single day for you guys. You just need to make sure to follow us on all different social medias. What are we doing now? Where are we? Pressing up. Already? Shoot. This was fast. Right on. Go. Up and down. 90 degrees. You see, I'm not resting that dumbbell on my shoulder. No. You have to hold it right above it. 90, 90. Shoulders back, chest is up. Just like that. Okay? Just the finish line. We did a lot of them today. 
you guys here today. I'm gonna stay together for a second. Ah, almost there. And time. We did it. We did it. We did it. High five. High five. High five. Jovic, Jovic. And we're gonna stretch. Guys, you gonna stay with stretches for me for a second? Mm -hmm. Now we gotta go. All right, he's getting ready for school. The drink, we don't have oranges, drink water, okay? That's not fresh, send you. Okay, so see the picture. All right, truly, maybe. I have a stretch drop, and we're gonna do a stretching. Now, you don't have that, it's fine. Just lay down on the floor, just do this stretch. Always let the heart rate go, go down. If your heart rate is super high up right now, just drink your water. Uh, just, I gotta get mine. Just give yourself a moment before you're gonna go down on the floor and do this, okay? Drinking water, staying hydrated is the key. If you haven't watched my episode on Nautilus Ladies, watch it because I was talking about what are jobs, habits. All right, let's do this. Uh, we're gonna hold a static stretch. So we're gonna lay down on the floor. That stretch drop is awesome because, look, now I can bring my toes down. Toes are down and that's it's gonna stretch hamstrings, calves right here. Okay, so just hold it down, hold it. Feels good, this is good to stretch. I'm gonna stretch the hamstrings in all different ways. And we're gonna bring it in. Hold and stretch the glute right here. Deep breath in through your nose, exhale through your legs. Release, do on the other leg. You see, I'm not following up, up this stretch as I did for the warm up, it's a little bit different. Toes down. You gotta flex your foot. Please do not point, flex. This has to be towards you. To, in order for you to stretch the hamstring and the, and the calves, you gotta bring that toe down. Hold it. Hold it. Good, and now bring the leg in here. Good, and release it. Now, we're going to stretch. Turn around, and no bend. So from your fourth position, like if you are on your four, you can bring left leg forward right here. The right leg is extended. Make sure that everybody can see me right here. All right, right? Like, just like that, just like this. Look, this is what is gonna get your glute, the inner thighs, hip flexors, a very nice deep stretch. We're gonna go slowly down in your forearms, and if you feel comfortable, you can go down and extend your arms here and just stay low, that's it. And just relax, let the, your own body weight push down, okay? This is all about like just relaxing right now. Good, and I want you to switch to the other leg. I already know that I feel comfortable. You know where you can stop to and you can go down. Guys, I wanted to challenge you today to think a little bit differently, to really look at your habits, the good ones, the bad ones. Have you been challenging yourself enough? Have your life has been just like mediocre life and just going through the motion and just doing the same thing over and over without really scaling, learning, developing yourself? Because Remember, life is endless university. This is what we need to do. This is in order for us to change the scale, to make more money, become more successful, you need to 
develop yourself, right? So this is very, very important. But the thing is that with workouts, in order to be successful in other areas of your life, you really need to be successful in your in your nutrition, in your mindset, like like have, have healthy habits. This will gonna because if you are already so committed to the good habits, right? It's gonna be so easy for you to change the other habits of your life. So if this is in place, is this is already developed, I'm sure you're gonna be able to develop other areas of your life. And of course, if you need help with anything and help with scheduling yourself, getting a grip of your life, you just need to send us a message, send me a message. We offer coaching 101, the peak performance operate to dominate uh, 101 and also the group. So this is just a part of the whole big umbrella, big spectrum of heavy, having a healthy, and happy successful life so send me a message i do a lot of coaching with women steve does a lot of with men and let's do this is get you going so peak freaks thank you so much for joining i will talk to you later guys no excuses peak freaks i want to see who did this workout so make sure that when you were playing when you were on the application you actually using the application, rate the workout, make sure that all your, app, all your apps are connected so your heart rate is measured and other things. Make sure to do this and stay active on the application side so we can see your activity if you're doing things good. Talk to you soon, no excuses.